If you didn't stay up last night, you missed a good one. The Chiefs visited the Texans in the Week 5 edition of Sunday Night Football right here on KOMU 8. Kansas City came in as the only unbeaten in the NFL. Could they keep a zero in the L column? Alex Smith came in averaging, averaging over 250 yards passing per game. Closing minutes of the first quarter, Smith would start counting towards that 250. He rolls out and hooks up with Char Kendrick West. This would put Kansas City up 13-0. And Wes would go along to fix his fake hair in the end zone. Score now 16 to 7 Chiefs when Smith calls on West again. Here West with the big time yards after the catch, dancing his way into the end zone. And that hair still out of place. Head to the fourth quarter now. We get a look at Clemson product quarterback Deshaun Watson. Steps up and hits Will Fuller right in the numbers. A 48 yard Texans touchdown to make it 26 to 20. Kansas City, a close one. Watson exited the game with the best QBR in the entire league. Unfortunately for him, though, he would also exit the game a loser. Tyreek Hill fields this punt at the Kansas City 18, makes the first Texan defender missed, secures the corner, turns on the afterburners. He's got a convoy of blockers ahead of him. His third punt return TD of the season, fifth of his career. Chiefs go on to win 42 to 34. They move to 5 and 0 and hold on to that coveted undefeated record. Tight end Travis Kelsey would exit the game with a concussion, though. Coach Andy Reid said he experienced memory loss. Tough times for Mizzou soccer, as the women have lost their last four games, giving up a total of 15 goals in that span. Yesterday, they tried to right the ship. We'll pick it up. Second half, game tied at one. Sarah Lubert goes down in the box, but is awarded a penalty kick. She cashes in, rolling it into the left corner of the goal to give the Tigers the lead. And this one would go to overtime. Just four minutes into that overtime, Tennessee cashes in with the golden goal. KDJ Shaw wins it for the Vols. Mizzou with its fifth straight loss in a heartbreaking 3-2 overtime fashion. And now to the hardwood, some Mizzou volleyball. First set, Tigers up 24-17. And Alyssa Munlin puts it away. Last week's SEC Co-Defensive Player of the Week had eight kills and five blocks yesterday. Tigers go up 1-0. Second set, Kayla Caffey picks up the kill. She hit 909 yesterday. That is the second highest single game hitting percentage in program history. Mizzou wins the second set. Finally, third match, match point rather, Ole Miss serves it long. Tigers pick up their fourth straight win. Three sets to nothing. And now we'll take a look at the two American League Division Series that played yesterday. Red Sox took their first game of the series against the Astros. Astros took an early lead with the Carlos Correa homer, but the Boston bullpen did not give up a run, including four scoreless innings by David Price. Game four will be played tonight at noon central. The Yanks with a 1-0 win over the Indians in the other American League Series, but the Indians still lead the series 2-1. That'll do it for sports.